and some guy, which is going to be uh, Cloud and the big fat guy. King the, K. Yeah. K. yeah. I'm over here not remembering <laughs> names. That's hilarious. Well, this is kind of hilarious, and you like kind of think that like K. Rool is like bad, but like K. Rool has so many tools to be able to just like box people, which is kind of crazy. He's, like he's a surprisingly competent close quarters man. Yeah, like his foot just like makes for like a really bad like time for people, which like you would never expect. You know what I mean? And then there's that. Just hit, hit it on both sides. Do it again. Just and again. And like also the armor adds into it too. He actually just and armored through most of that blade beam. That is hilarious. I think we're seeing a lot of like insta seven guy. Like I feel like some guy isn't playing bad. I think when he like gets that ledge is like where he's probably gonna be struggling the most, especially against like Glintendo, because Cloud has like a really good like ledge pressure game. And like if you're not careful, you just like either get reversal or you like get even worse if you're not really careful. Goodbye. But that you know back throw is just drag your good. face into the dirt in the mud. Oh, what the heck happened? Uh he definitely looked at his controller. That was a flub of some sort. That was a Miss Empire? Or maybe it's a self handicap saying, you know what? Let's Not fight a on more <laughs> even footage. <laughs> Not <laughs> you you are so washed that I'm gonna need to give you, you know, a, a, a stock or two. That is so mean. <laughs> you you don't know you don't know how these crocs work. I'm not talking about the ones wearing the shoes, buddy boy. That is absolutely crazy. Um, I'm the parry on the last one. We definitely see a lot of like um, spot dodging from you know some guy whenever they go for like you know something that they obviously know is gonna work, which is like has been kind of working. He's really good in like when they're in disadvantage, but they could probably use a little bit more of like their tools to just like how do you say um, armor through a lot of the moves that Cloud has. He literally just armored through some of them. That is very true. But he, when it coming off a ledge, forward air and up air back to back, and that's so upsetting. But it's fine. You're right. I'm just saying, like, I, I'm just saying, like, I wish I could do that. I wish I didn't have to deal with Cloud's strike pressure. But Cloud is bad. What by being Cloud? <laughs> Quite literally. You heard it here, folks. And are you gone? Oh no! This disadvantage. Gate box to stage. Yes. This is Call hilarious. Three, two, yep. Uh oh, that was really nice. Le um, what's it called? Play from some guy right there. Some guy just really needs to like get himself back into a situation where he can just get control of stage. Not sure I feel about these counters off the ledge. It makes sense, but like also, like I think some guy needs to just worry about getting to stage rather than like staying in one spot. Oh my god, that was so nice, and that would have killed if Nintendo didn't get away. I think lots of uh, scared spot dodging right now. No one wants to commit to anything, even though Glenn's a stock up. Oh, and that's gonna kill. I think that's, I think that's the third time you got caught doing that. I would. Rethink my ledge approach. Game one going to Glen Tender. Yeah, I knew that. I, I mean, it, it, it like the way that some guy plays that ledge. It isn't bad. I, didn't, I, didn't, I, I think that like some guy just needs to have like a little bit more of a way to just get back to stage. There it is. That that was that was the second stock, and the third stock went the same way. That is hilarious. Hopefully, uh, if, if he can somehow hear me in the ether, even though we're like. 50 feet apart right now and behind curtains. If, if, you, if you can the, hear me, uh, maybe. The counter bikes. It's not right for you. <laughs> you, got it. you got it. I love it. Well, okay, so honestly, I, other than the counters, like, I, I love jumping from ledge, but I came to the conclusion that not everybody can jump from ledge because it's bad. Especially against Cloud. Like, jump, jump, the, from, jump the wrong way and mm, mighty minus three bear. Maybe the bear, maybe the uh, bee, maybe like a few other things. Jazzy, you may have a warped sense of how safe it is to jump off a ledge. Because I play Considering the bear? character you play. I know, that, that I know. But Not like, every character can like jump off the ledge then do a fucking... 90 degree shot right but to the like, middle of the stage. I'm, I'm not talking about like just like jump off ledge and then You're back. Dead. I'm talking about just regular jump. 
I didn't know that like people have different ways of get up jumping, and I'm like, wow, some people have better jumps than the others, and it's hilarious. I can up, I just spin shot above, but I just get that whole situation. That's usually oh, crazy. Okay, combo. No, that's hilarious. Oh wow, you were about to see, get see, styled I, on. I, I, I like where your head was at. Just a uh, just a little misspaced. Uh oh! Oh, yo, some guy is trying to style on Glintendo here, and that is hilarious. Can we get a third? That's the real question. Here. Uh oh, the lead chopping. Uh oh, the smack. It happened! At last. Uh oh, back air. Back air! Okay, that that wasn't back air. I called out the incorrect move. It's coming move. now. Uh oh. Uh oh. Now not as much. I, I want, I want Glintendo okay, to get you cheese. Can, you can get the, all right. I was about to say, you can get the, all right. No, he didn't get cheese. That would be hilarious if he did. What a, what a reversal. I'm like really going hard for this funny character. K Rule's not funny. K Rule's just. He's funny to me. <laughs> that is crazy. He's not even that funny. He's just a little dumb and stinky. He's a freaking alligator. He's a goon, is what he is. I don't know about that one. But you do be partaking in goon activity sometimes. I, I will be. I will be. I will be fair about that. Okay, back air. I love it. Down air. No. Right, what's the follow up? Okay, okay. Not quite. However, you are about to re- Oh, no, maybe not. You better be careful. Ah! He's dead. He's actually dead. No, he's not. Oh, okay. I knew it. He's so lucky that he didn't die from that. Oh, my God. You are trying to die again. That's crazy. He quite literally, like, jumped from ledge. Are you a madman? With Cloud? I feel I feel like some guy has he has the ideas of what to do, but the execution isn't quite there. Yeah, honestly, it's just a little bit more of like working on like oh, your ideas for a little bit more. Because he has the right ideas of how he wants to get like back to stage. Because I think that's the most important part, especially playing a heavy. You need to have an idea of how to get back to stage. And when you don't have that like um you know, that important part, it really leads to situations where you do stuff like that and you don't know how to get off ledge. And the set going to Glintendo, taking first blood of the day. I knew Glintendo was going to win. It didn't matter that you, he was you, you knew it in your bones. No, like, deep in my soul, and my heart was quite literally crying at the fact that, like, Glenn just just knew. I Like, I just knew. Like, I don't have a rhyme and or a reason. Like, it just happened. Sometimes you just will the will. You so you will the will to win into the player you want to win on screen, and it'll just happen. No, like my will becomes manifested and turns into reality. No, like, and I love how this is like turning into like a whole analogy about willing and therefore being, and then manifesting, and then just whole funny stuff that does not make any sense to anybody who's listening to I me. Therefore, I am. <laughs> I am. Therefore, I be.